back to you. I've got to go back into there. So I've got to connect with this. So we have Fred, who is just high level repeat for me because I've just got to connect to so it again. Causing issues with people that we work with and people that work yep. with us. And yep. And what you want for him is for his capacity to be a leader, to become evident, your, or to be manifest or in living in the world, your, you have concerns um, uh, and you've contributed by letting it go, what are the other things, not, se not setting the boundary, control, you know, all of that sort of stuff. And Okay, great. A, a, a yeah, so I'm just going to have a stab at this. It's, we had it a while ago, so I'm just going to have a stab at this. How I would how I would frame this with Fred. Something along the lines of this, and you're going to be Fred in this circumstance. Okay. Yeah. All right. All right. <laughs> so what I would how I frame it's Fred. What I really want for you is for your enormous capacity as a leader to be, become evident for everybody. And I know and I recognise that it, we haven't, you know, we've had some issues and so on and, and you have felt like there's been a lot of control and, and in our relationship. I am not experiencing what is happening, you know, how you're showing up in leadership as the best that you've got and I know that you've got better than that. I know you've got better than that. And um, I know that I haven't been helping by the way I've been letting this run ex and, and so on, it's causing me to feel uh, a lot of um, concern personally. I'm fumbling this bit, but you know, get, the, get the point. Um, I'm wondering if you'd be willing to have a, a conversation, really sit down and, and explore both sides of this and, and make a commitment for both of us to work this through until we reach a place that is good for both of us. How are you going? Would you be willing? Yep. Am I good? Yeah, something like that. So what we do with this process, and that's why it's so important, is this, we have to get clear on our interior so that when we come into that conversation, you can come from those places. If we're afraid of doing something or making a mistake, name it. I'm really, I'm, I'm actually really concerned about having this conversation because it feels like it's way out of my comfort zone and way out of my ability and I don't want to hurt you. If that's true, say it. Say it. If, but also own, I know I have contributed to the situation that we've got here because I've done this, I've done that. Own it. Say it. You still holding the space of what you want for Fred is the highest. It's evident in the entire delivery. There's no point that it's missing. So you still want that. And then you're inviting, would you be willing to do whatever it is, you know, to sit down and do that. You're still in your heart still speaking, you're creating an enormous open field for Fred to say yes. And that's where you go. Alright? Mm -hmm. It's a very powerful process. Mm 